Welcome to Comment Cocktails, Dan, Derek, and Ian are gonna make for you. Well, we're gonna review for we're, we're you. We're gonna make a glass of gin. We're we're, yeah, gin. we're not really gonna. We're gonna taste something. We're gonna taste some gin. This is uh, Juvine uh, Floraison. There's a new Noison or New I don't know. I, I don't. Not French. It's Waison. Huh? Okay. Well, there's two of them. One's a dry, London Dry. This is not the London Dry. This is the um, Floraison, which is a grape base instead of the standard. Dry, which is going to be like distilled from hell, whatever they distill from wheat. I don't know. However, they make yep. it sugar. Depends on the gin. Any kind of sugar, right? Yeah. Um, I was expecting this to be a metal cap just because of the knurling on it. It's not metal? No, it's plastic. No, it is definitely not metal. Um, That's tasty. Funny yeah. story. So I think it's about, I put the price, I'm, tr I'm trying to be mm, better about putting good. the price there ahead of time. $38 okay. or so. Um, floral, go figure. This works. Mm, it's yes, it's floral. floral. So the story behind this is um, G-Vine was one of the first spirits I reviewed on EverydayDrinkers.com, which is now common at cocktails.com. And like it got a lot of views. And then I had this bottle I didn't know what to do with. So when I started the show, that became the gin I would use because I had it. I had both of them. Uh, so then they sent it to me again. I'm like, well, I've never actually done the review on YouTube before because it was 2008, I think, or before Ancient that. History. Yeah, ancient history. I might have done it on a video, on an audio podcast once. It's near the beginning of the interwebs time there. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Through space and time. <laughs> it's good. It and, is very floral. That's sweet. Yes. Mm. It's kind of sweet. And the other thing mm. is, I have drank substantially more gin now than I did during that time. So I wasn't sure how that would play into my... Because before, I was like, this is the best thing on earth. Like, I really liked it because it didn't taste like the, the London Dry. No. That was the core didn't thing like to tangeray. me. Right, it didn't taste like tangere, and I was I like, I have found my thing. Like, this is so much better. But I don't know exactly how this plays into a standard cocktail, because it's going to have floral notes to it. Right. And I don't know if that's going to be good for everything. Probably for a gin. Topic. I was going to say G&T, I bet it's good. G that's, a, that's a one problem with all these different gins. They're good, good for G&Ts, yeah. but, like, you start putting them into, mm -hmm. like, drinks. But Especially, like, a martini or something, and sometimes they don't. But I think most people G &T is just still like drink standard. gin and tonic. Like, yeah. there's so many people who are just, everything's, like, I've made so many freaking gin cocktails, like, over the years, and I try to get everybody to drink them, and everybody's always talking about the gin and tonic, and, and gin, dry, dry martinis and stuff like that. Like, that's just what, because it's easy. Know. This is, it's Dan style. Like, boom, 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 I'm done. Yeah, it's easy. That's what, like, after a while, you're just like, mm, I'm just it's making refreshing. a martini. It's, yeah. Yeah. Or but this, martini or G and T. A G and T, yeah. like in the summer, Both G and T's. Pretty easy. You can't beat them. No, no. But this has that, like, definitely like a floral note. Like it's just all floral. Mm. There's not a lot of that dry finish is not there. It's got the sweet finish. It does, it but it's good also not super citrusy like an American gin. So no. it doesn't follow the lanes you'd expect. There, I mean, I've had floral gins. I think the botanical one. Well, like the Citadel or? Or this one, like the Botanist maybe. I don't know. There's other ones that are Citadel. Is that floral? Or is this more like American? No, that's just London Dry. Yeah. Yeah, these have, and it's from France, right? Like, but they all make it in the same, that's French, but they make those in the, the idea and the concept of a London Dry gin. These, the, and these guys have one, but they're like, fuck that. We make something different, which is what's interesting. Sipping, I like it. Simple mm. drinks, I like it. I mm. think it'll confuse aviation, the crap yeah. out of you in some of them. Like, uh, what was he saying? Good in aviation, probably. It'll be interesting yes. in aviation. Yeah. It'll be, I mean, it's really Because aviation is really based on an American yeah. gin, right? Well, it's also got the creme de volette, which is mm -hmm. a floral. Mm. Oh, that could really yeah. screw it up, though. But, like, it, it can only well, take maybe, so many very vibrant notes before it gets really muddy and... Yeah, that's true. It's like going I mean, to Macy's. Maybe it doesn't contrast it. Sometimes, yeah, it might not. sometimes you can have a big contrast oh, yeah, yeah. too. So it might work. Yeah. We just don't know. I say you like try. said, it's sweet too. Yeah, there's only one way to really find out. Yeah, yeah, you drink a lot of it. We're just gonna have to make one. <laughs> we have the power. We have the power. We um, will do that after. And it's not burning. No, no, which not I at all. Like. You're also drinking out of the normal tasting glass too, which makes everything less burning. Yeah. Mm. But it's also got 100% grape neutral spirit. But it does have a good nose. It smells, yeah. it smells, it smells nice. It smells like it tastes almost. It's her. Oh, it's clean. I thought I heard like a bottle pop and like something pouring out of it. It sounded like oh. water splashing. It was you typing. 
Uh, <laughs> I heard something over there, and I saw you look, so I go, I don't know, cause and effect. <laughs> it's her. Yeah. Uh, like, I don't know. You're like, it tastes good, smells good. You're like, like her. And I was like, wait a minute, what? <laughs> I like girls. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Sidebar, more videos, uh, probably gin-based, since if you're watching this, you're probably into gin. If you've got this far, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, but you probably already do, because you're watching this far. Then watch the next one. Right. Hit the bell notification so you can see the French 75 get made. Actually, that might go off first. Doesn't matter. No. What did you drink?